Cobra Kai will be returning for a fourth season at the end of this year, continuing the nostalgia train nearly 40 years after the original Karate Kid movie debuted. As part of their global fan event Tudum, Netflix debuted an exclusive first look at season 4 of the hit show, centered around the iconic All Valley Karate Championship. William Zabka and Ralph Macchio return as their classic characters, Johnny Lawrence and Daniel LaRusso, this time as allies after teaming up during season 3 against one common enemy, Cobra Kai. That squad includes John Kreese, who took control of the dojo, and Terry Silver, the original owner. The dramatic sneak peek showed Johnny and Daniel working together to train their students and prepare them for the upcoming championship, albeit through their own unique training styles, the third season of the streaming hit picked up where season 2 left off after a school brawl broke out between Cobra Kai and Miyagi-Do, leaving Miguel Diaz, Johnny's protege, in a coma caused by his son, Robbie Keane, who is Daniel's student. Along with the aftermath of the brawl, Johnny's former sensei, John, betrays him and takes control of the Cobra Kai dojo along with its former students. The third season of the show also brought back another character from the original movie. Elizabeth Shue reprised her character, Ali Mills, for the final two episodes of the season as a blast from the past for both Johnny and Daniel. In fact, it's her character that pushes the two long-time enemies to join forces, telling them, you guys are more alike than you want to admit and maybe you recognize parts of yourselves in each other and maybe you don't always like what you see. As if a fourth season of the fan favorite show wasn't enough, Netflix renewed Cobra Kai for season five months ahead of the season four premiere, which will hit the streaming platform on December 31, 2021. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.